And that's the Wyndham, our finest new home. Any questions? Yeah, what grade of installation do you use? Grade? Uh, yeah, R13, R15, R19. Hey, what are we playing, bingo here? It's fuzzy, it makes you itch. It's all the same. Wrong, wrong, wrong. The grade of insulation makes a big difference. It's your lifetime mortgage that's affected by it. What's a lifetime mortgage? It's a utility bill. You never pay off your utilities. They're always gonna send you a bill every month and you want it to be as low as possible. If you're building a brand new home, try to go with a two by six exterior wall instead of a two by four. That extra two inches doesn't cost much in the way of lumber, plus it doesn't cost much in the way of insulation, but it's gonna save you money for the rest of your life that you live in that home. A two by four can only hold an R13 grade of insulation. Insulations come in grade, and the thicker they are, the higher the grade, the more energy efficient. A two by six wall has more room so you can go to an R19 insulation. Now a lot of people think, well I can take an R19 and just shove it into a two by four wall. You can't do that because when you compress insulation, it closes all the air valleys and pockets that are inside the insulation. The fiberglass isn't what insulates, it's the air trapped between the fiberglass. So whenever you compress it down, you compress all those air pockets, and it's no longer energy efficient. You need to go ahead and upgrade to the 2x6 wall, if it's not a standard, and go with the R19 insulation. Now when you go up into the attic, it's normally not going to be bat insulation, it's going to be just blown in. So there's no number you can just read on the exterior, but it's measured by how deep and how thick it is. A lot of builders like to use an R22 up in the attic, maybe an R30, but that's really not enough. I highly recommend you go ahead and upgrade to an R38. R38 will work anywhere in the country. It's going to keep those utility bills low. If you don't have much insulation in your attic, you can add some. You can go out to a hardware store and if you buy the insulation, they'll even uh, give you a blower to use. It's not hard to add. If you don't want to go in the attic and fill it up with insulation, you're going to be filling it up with money every month that you live in that house. Go ahead and get R38 in the attic and while you're building those walls go to a 2x6 and use an R19.